Hey guys, welcome back to Slightly Unusual Magic TV. My name's Craig. First of all, do me a favour and hit subscribe to the channel. Uh, second of all, I'm going to show you an amazing trick today uh, by uh, Alakazam. Uh, it's been put out by Alakazam. It's called Zenamatch. Now, what we have here is we have uh, Zena cards. Now, Zena cards uh, are designed to test extra sensory perception. Um, and if you've ever seen Ghostbusters at the beginning, you probably saw them being used. They've been used in a lot of films. I don't believe in psychic powers. I don't believe in ESP, but I do believe in being able to influence people. And I'm here with Ryland and Theo. I'm going to try and influence Ryland. Now, this is very interesting because these cards are really old. You can get new packs, but this is being, I got this from like the 1980s. And this is a very rare color match set, um, which you didn't see very often with Zena cards. There you go, useless information that you didn't need to know. But anyway, uh, we're going to try and do this uh, and put this over here for a minute. We'll put this there. Right, so. If you've not seen Zena cards before, let me explain. Um, basically, uh, there's five cards in a set. You have a circle, you have a square, you have a star, you have a, uh, a, a cross, and you have some wavy lines. And I've got two sets, one for Ryland and one for me. Now, I'm going to mix mine up first of all, just to make sure they are well mixed up. And I'm just going to just deal them in a row on my little mat here. One, two, three, four, five. Perfect. Now, Ryan, we're going to mix yours up for you, and we're going to do it in a very interesting way. You're going to say to me, deal or uh, split. If you say deal, I'll deal the card onto the table, top card on the table. If you say split, I'll change the positions of the top two cards and then just drop them on the table. So deal would be like that, while split would be like that. Do you understand? Yeah. So let's go. Deal or split. And I'll do it face down so we don't know which one's which. Deal or split? Split. Perfect. And again? Deal. And again? Split. Perfect. Do you want to do it again? Yeah. Okay, deal or split? Deal. 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 You can be very annoying, you know that? Let's do it one more time. Deal or split? Uh, deal. Split. Split. Okay, is that fair? Yeah. And just to make it even more random, just cut the cards and complete the cut. Just give the cards a cut and complete the cut. You are so good. Do you want to do one, uh, yeah, complete the cut? Complete the cut? Do you want to do one more cut or are you happy? I'm happy. Rylan, if you are happy, my little fella, then uh, then I'm happy as well. Okay, good. This is what we're going to do. I'm just going to put these out like this. I'm not going to change the order. I'm going to put them out exactly how you put them out. Is that fair? Yeah. Now, you mix these up yourself. You decided uh, dealing or splitting, and then you cut the cards anywhere, and then we put them out exactly as you wanted. We put them out like this. No one could have predicted that, could we? No one could have predicted exactly what shapes you would put down. Now, obviously, they've not matched, but there was something I wasn't telling you, Ryland. The thing I wasn't telling you is that when this is done, the cards are face down, so you don't get influence. Because sometimes, uh, back in the day when they used to test for this sort of thing, uh, card cheats would be able to manipulate cards. And if these cards were face up, then what would happen is they'd be able to cheat and, and, and arrange it in such a way that, that they matched. So I wanted to make sure that you weren't influenced by my cards, even put, put them down first. But what I didn't tell you is these cards are actually face down. What I wanted uh, you to match is on the other side of these cards. You see, on the other side of the star are the three wavy lines, which is exactly what you dealt there after shuffling and cutting. On the other side of the cross is the red circle. On the other side of the three wavy lines is the square. On the other side of the circle is the star. And on the other side of the square is the cross. And you managed to get a perfect match, my friend, which tells me, Ryland, you are absolutely, unequivocally, totally and utterly psychic. Guys, I hope you enjoyed that. Thank you very much for watching. Uh, make sure that you subscribe to the channel and also check that out on Alakazam. It's a great trick. Subscribe to the channel. We go live every single day at six o'clock with a brand new magic performance. So catch it, uh, catch it again and I'll, uh, I'll see you tomorrow. Have a good night.